for you. That's always there. A gift? A gift from the heavens, to be more accurate. I've just found it by the owner's dead body. May it be of more use to you. Here. My very first weapon. It's gone flat. <laughs> Look at you and your sophisticated palate. Drink. Who would have thought the end of the world could be so peaceful? Yeah, at least until night falls. True. I wish Crane could have seen this. But who? Doesn't matter. Crane was... Oh my god! Was Spy from the first game? Because Crane was the main character in the first game. I tracked down that guy for you. I haven't played the game in three years, so I forgot everything. Why didn't you say so earlier? And you're only telling me now. <laughs> when I tossed you a beer, thought you guessed right away we're celebrating. Whoa. The guy's in Villador. Supposedly he knows something about walls. Villador. I saw him that close, huh? Hey, I, I got a favor to ask you. You deliver this to Gary, it's on your way. People don't like pilgrims there, but, but they pay well. And where do people like pilgrims? Well, they're afraid of us. Everyone does their best to survive. Maybe. But when something needs to be transported through the hordes of infected, then suddenly they're knocking on our doors. All right. But you owe me one. Aren't you going to get paid? One. I like so that. what about that guy? Well... I talked to him over the radio. He didn't tell me his name. Sounds like he's got something to hide. See that antenna on the hill? That'll help you contact the informant. He'll be listening for you at dawn on a frequency of 140.200 megahertz. Told him he'd hear from you soon. Do you know what he wants in return? What does he want in return? Didn't say. But he didn't sound like the kind of guy who does things for free. I don't think that kind of guy exists. What? What about me? You're an old <laughs> fart who likes racing me and makes me ask around about his crazy girlfriend. Hey, hey, hey. She's not crazy. Jane's just maybe, well, a little hot-headed. And she's always getting herself into trouble. But if you could get a load of her... <laughs> Whoa, all right. Still too early in the evening for that sort of talk. Eyes. I was gonna say eyes. Beautiful. Steely. Huge. Never heard anyone get so worked up about gray eyes. Because you don't know shit about the world. Let alone women. Yeah, you're probably right. I'm telling you. I'll finally find Jane. We'll set up a house. Oh. We'll live there. No one's gonna drive us out. And I'll stop wondering like a moron. I'll drink to that. You actually seem like a really good guy. <laughs> and that waltz. What's his deal? Is he family? No. Not at all. <laughs> then why are you looking for him? Will you tell me sometime? Yeah. Yeah, one day. Well, my time's up. So when will I see you again, huh? In another two years? Maybe. Take care, man. I hope you find that waltz guy, or whoever you're looking for. And remember, 140.200 megahertz. At dawn, the guy's waiting for you. Thanks, Pike. Legit good dude, dude. <laughs> so now, let's check out, because we have a new weapon. Go to the radio. Okay, so we have the classic Skyrim um, quest line. Not quest line, dude. The um, quest level. Uh, I want to see the, the level because I know my weapon won't last forever. And it's one of the first weapons, so it's not.